tributes have been paid to the civil rights campaigner Darkus Howe, who's died at the age of 74. The writer and broadcaster campaigned for black rights and against racism for more than 50 years. Our correspondent Elaine Dunkley looks back at his life. In the fight against police brutality and racism, heroes of a struggle were born. Darkus Howe, a prominent figure in the British Black Panther movement. In the 1970s, he was arrested, charged with inciting a riot, with a group of activists protesting about police harassment at the Mangrove restaurant in Notting Hill. It was a completely non-event until you looked around and saw about 600 police. And we thought, hell, what's this? At the trial, all nine were cleared. The Mangrove Nine became a landmark case exposing heavy-handed police tactics towards the black community. In 1981, Darkus Howe organised a 20,000-strong Black People's Day of Action in protest over the police handling of the investigation into the new crossfire in which 13 black teenagers died. Darkus was a, a fearless warrior. He helped to establish a tradition of um, black self-organisation in order to, to tackle racial oppression. Mr. Howe, if oh, I... Darkus Howe, at times controversial and confrontational. You. you are not a stranger to riots yourself, I understand, are you? Following the London riots in 2011, there was this heated exchange. I have never taken part in a single riot. I've been on demonstrations that ended up in a conflict and have some respect for an old West Indian Negro and stop accusing me of being a rioter. At the Commonwealth Institute, an art exhibition is on show. As well as an activist, he was a well-known broadcaster and writer, always formidable and fearless. For more than 50 years, Darkus Howe was at the forefront of the fight against racism. Darkus Howe, who's died at the age of 74.